Hey everybody, it's me, the old humble guy. I'm heading back from the distillery, traveling through the woods. Uh, don't worry, it's safe, I promise. Uh, but I want to talk a little bit about In Vino Veritas. In Vino Veritas, is, it, it means something. In, in wine, there's truth, basically. That's kind of the Trump down version, the dumbed down version of it. But, but I, I say that for a reason, and it's because um, I do a lot of tastings, do a lot of samplings, a lot of demos. In a given Friday-Saturday combo, I'll give out hundreds of samples. I've, I've done thousands, hundreds of demos, thousands of samples. And you can give me any dumb excuse you want if you don't want to have a sample. That's fine. I don't care. I, I've heard them all. But the dumbest of them all, the dumbest of them all, uh, close second, close second being, oh, I don't know if I'll be able to stop. Oh, you'll be able to stop. I'm only going to give you a quarter of an ounce. I'm not giving you any more than that. But the dumbest of them all, dumber even than that, is, oh, I don't think I'll be able to control it. Whiskey makes me do dumb things. Now, look here. Whiskey doesn't make you do dumb things. Whiskey doesn't make you do dumb things any more than vodka makes you do dumb things or tequila makes you do dumb things. If you don't do dumb things when you drink vodka, you don't do dumb things when you drink whiskey. That's all you. That's all you. All of that was inside of you. It was all inside of you. Don't blame it on the whiskey. The whiskey doesn't, doesn't put bad things. It doesn't, the whiskey didn't make you get on the table and take off your shirt. Whiskey didn't make you lose one of your boots. Whiskey didn't make your pants fall down. Whiskey didn't do that. That was you. That was inside of you. You let that out. That was you. That was all on you. If you're a good person when you're sober and you're a terrible person when you're drunk, you're a terrible person when you're sober acting like a good person. You don't have to like that, but that's true. Alcohol doesn't put a bad person inside of you. Alcohol puts alcohol inside of you. And it takes down your barriers, takes down your inhibitions, and make and allows you to do dumb things when you otherwise wouldn't do dumb things. But you're still doing the dumb things. So don't go blaming whiskey for you being a terrible person. In vino veritas. The real you comes out when you put alcohol inside of you. The you that you're acting like is walking about among civilized people. The real you inside you, the you you're masking, that's what comes out. So don't act like it's whiskey's fault. Don't blame vodka. Don't blame vodka for your bad behavior. Don't blame tequila for your bad behavior. There's nothing in tequila that's a, that's a fight protein. There's nothing in whiskey that's a fight protein. There's nothing in vodka that's a fight protein that you drink it and you do dumb things. All of that stuff is in, all of that same stuff is in beer. All of that same stuff is, the only differences in vodka and whiskey is, is tannins from the wood, the, the aging from the oak. That's all. That, it's the same alcohol. It's the same water. Act like it's the whiskey making you do dumb things. It's you making you do dumb things. Quit blaming the whiskey. Own it. Have some personal responsibility for your dumb actions. Quit blaming the wit. I mean, I would rather, when I'm doing the tastings, I would much rather people just be honest and be all like, nah, I don't want to. I don't want to try it. I don't want to try new things. That's fine. Don't try new things. I mean, the worst that could happen is you'll find your new favorite whiskey and your, your old expectations will be shattered. Like, oh no, I can't just drink my default crap bourbon anymore. I have to drink something good. I have to think about my life choices. But don't lie to me. Don't lie to me. Stop and tell me your family history and your life story and all that. Oh, I can't because blah, blah, 1970. I don't care. And absolutely don't tell me that if you drink the whiskey, you're going to, oh, it's going to make me start stripping. Nope, it's not going to make you start stripping. You wanted to strip. You're looking for an excuse. And please don't strip. Please. We're in a store. We're in a public place. Keep your damn clothes on. That's all I'm saying. Keep your damn clothes on. Don't use whiskey as an excuse to strip. It's a good reason to, though. <laughs> it's a great reason. It's not an excuse, but it is a great reason. Anyway, in vino veritas. Cheers, everybody.